Hi, I'm Dr. Terry Kennedy. Today's Dose of Power Living is Set Your Vision Free, inspired by Michelangelo. This is Power Living for all things wellness, empowerment, and success. Meet me back here in a moment, and let's dive in. As Michelangelo said, I saw the angel in the marble and carved until I set him free. Let me say that again. I saw the angel in the marble and carved until I set him free. What do you see? Imagination is at the heart of creation. It is a gift we each have. It fuels innovation in business, joy in love, and adventure in life. As children, our imaginations are very active. Research has shown that kids spend as much as two-thirds of their time in imaginative play. They don't know what is not possible. Yet, their natural tendency to daydream and wonder declines sharply around fourth grade. It seems as we become conditioned by societal norms and are penalized for being wrong we retract into logic and reason. Don't let past failures and rejection chip away at possibility thinking. If you see it, you really can experience it. We each have something special to contribute. An artist uses a paintbrush. A dancer uses her body. Some of us use our lives. We all have the tools that are right for us. Reflect on what you really want and set your vision free. Shut out external influences so you can capture on paper what is in your mind's eye. Make sure you have a solid foundation conceptually by sketching out a blueprint. Then add elements piece by piece. Be patient. The manifestation of your dreams may not happen right away. It takes commitment and persistence to realize any major goal. Just as a sculptor chips away at the marble to reveal his work, systematically put shape to your vision. If you honor your inspirations through purposeful action, you will release your own masterpiece into the world. You have access to all the answers you need. You simply have to be still and know. So let's tune into breath and awareness itself. Our centering thought is I honor my vision. Allow your spine to be lifted and your heart open. Close your eyes or soften your gaze. Allow your breath to flow naturally. Feel the sensation of inspiration the process of drawing air into the lungs and spirit tusks or breath into your being. Notice where you are right in this moment without trying to change anything. Give yourself the gift of being present. Nowhere to go. No judgment. Be here now. Repeat to yourself, I honor my vision. I honor my vision. With each breath, allow this intention to seep into your cells. I honor my vision. I honor my vision. Allow the breath to take you deeper and deeper. Know that you have the ability to create what is in your mind's eye. Feel the energy of this power and enjoy it.
Begin to deepen the breath and bring your awareness back to your surroundings. Take a deep inhalation, drawing energy into the body and exhale slowly. And when you're ready, float the eyes open. How do you feel? It only takes a moment to transform your state of mind and body. Let's do an experiment with truth. Your call to action this week is to set your vision free. Ask yourself, how can I honor my vision? Listen to the whispers in your heart. What do you want to contribute to the world? This entire week, Spend time putting shape to one game-changing goal for your life. Seek to capture and solidify what is in your mind's eye. In what ways can you make your vision come alive? That's your practice this week. Let Michelangelo's words inspire you. I saw the angel in the marble and carved until I set him free. Let me know how it goes by commenting below. I'll check in at the end of the week to see how you did. Until next time, remember, it's your divine life. Live it to the fullest. The power is in your hands. I hope you enjoy this dose of power living. Be sure to like, share, and subscribe. Connect with us on the blog and through social media. For more, check out our courses and events. I'm here to help you have the clarity and the energy to manifest your destiny and create a life of prosperity. It's time. It's time for us all to live in flow, freedom, love, oneness, and wisdom. Repeat after me. I am power living.